If a drawing does not use datums and geometric tolerances, it's nothing more than a cartoon. About once a month, someone sends me one of these cartoons and asks me what it means. This tip is about one that I just received. If you want to see an extended video of this tip, be sure to sign up for our secure premium site. Now here's your tip. I continue to be amazed that there are still drawings out there like the one shown here where there's no datum features and there's no geometric tolerances and people actually think that this general tolerance will do the job. I don't know how to set the part up. I don't know what my origins of measurement are. I have lots of features to choose from. And some people argue, well, I know what they want. And sure, you know what they want. The trouble is, parts is parts. We can't make perfect parts. And I don't care how good the machinist or the toolmaker is, parts distort due to stress relief and heat treat and on and on. With just a few mouse clicks, I can create a drawing that takes away all these problems. Now I have datum features that establish the origins of measurement. I have position on the holes, I have a general profile that locates the surfaces, and this part is completely defined so that we know how much I can be off from perfect. So when you see a drawing like this in the future, my recommendation to you is run as fast as you can. Don't try to work with this. It's incomplete. Please don't bother asking me to interpret your cartoons. But if you want help making drawings that have one clear meaning, give us a call at Techies. Because at Techies, GD&T rules. I'll see you next tip.